Hey guys, it's Jessica. In today's video, I'm giving a makeover to this buffet. I picked this up from my local thrift store for $15. It is in really rough condition. The front baseboard is missing. There is chip veneer throughout, and it just really needs a good update and a new look. So, if you would like to see its transformation, just keep watching. outside and I'm going to be using my DeWalt hand orbital sander to sand off this finish. Now the one drawer had kind of a bubbled up place um, right under the um, handles. So I used some wood glue and a paintbrush and got it down in there and laid some heavy stuff on there and thought it was going to flatten out and dry nice and flat. Well it didn't so now it's just hard and warped. So. It is what it is. We'll see how it does with sanding. It is what it is. But anyways, we'll see how it goes. So let's get to sanding. So if you guys have been following my channel for any amount of time, you know I love furniture flipping and I love recycling, reusing old things. So we are currently in Montana right now on a three week, three week vacation to visit family and to visit our ranch that we have out here. Um, so I was just walking through this old house that's on the ranch. It is in really bad condition. So some there's like some old furniture and stuff. And I was looking at this little piece of furniture. This is like this little stool thing. I'm thinking about redoing for my sister-in-law for her Airbnb. But then I was looking at it and I was bent over and I looked back here and I saw this little piece of furniture, like this little stand thing. 
and has some really nice mid-century modern wooden legs to it. I'm thinking I'm gonna take those off and then take them home with me to Tennessee and use them for a piece of furniture that I'm gonna be redoing. So yeah, recycle and reuse. I love free stuff. <laughs>
complete transformation of what this piece used to look like. I love how it turned out. This may very well be my favorite piece that I have done to date. So I held on to this piece for a few months. I had it sitting in my workspace. Um, I was trying to figure out exactly what I was going to do to it. Actually, I think part of it I was procrastinating because it had so much damage and I just felt kind of overwhelmed with all the repair work needed and a little unsure how I was going to fix things. The biggest thing for me though was this front piece that was just pretty much destroyed and then it was a uh, press board that was below it so I had to cover it up with something and I wasn't sure exactly what to use but that Lou on board worked amazing. I sanded it so it was flush with that back, the rest of it and then I filled in any of the cracks and you can't even tell that it's on there so that was perfect. It is so crazy how much richer that this piece looks. It looks high dollar, super quality. It's gorgeous. I love it. So as always, let's talk numbers real quick. So I spent $15 to buy the buffet and for paint and primer and sealer, I have about $15 in that. For these gold knobs, I spent $5.22 on them. And for these knobs, I spent $14.16. Those are a little bit pricier, but I really think that they make this piece pop. So it was definitely worth the price. And for the drawer liner, I spent $5.48 and I used the entire roll. As always, I will link all the products that I use down in the description box below if you wanna check them out. So that's an all-in cost of $54.86. So I wanna get at least $250 out of this piece, but I'm gonna go ahead and list it on Facebook Marketplace for $325. Um, that way it gives me a little bit of wiggle room if people wanna offer me less or I can drop the price and grab some potential buyer's interest. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are not already a subscriber to our channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you guys in a later video.